Donald Trump is once again posing a possible threat to the country's safety. Earlier today, it was reported by Mother Jones that Trump had connections to a prostitution front Florida massage parlor after photos surfaced of Trump posing with its founder, Lee Cindy Yang. It was discovered that Yang had an investment business that is offered to sell Chinese clients access to Trump and his family, which is now being flagged as a national security risk by an intelligence expert. David Rothkopf, a Carnegie Endowed intelligence and national security expert, has stated that if Yang's massage parlor was actually giving the Chinese access to Trump, he could be putting the country in grave danger. Rothkopf said if the President of the United States is letting a Chinese madam sell access at Mar-a-Lago to Chinese business people, while his friends are getting serviced at businesses she started, he is making himself and the country vulnerable to massive blackmail risk. He also said that, if it were true, it'd be a textbook story of how foreign actors gain leverage over senior officials. Rothkopf stressed just how important the details in the Mother Jones report were. He said if the Steele dossier had contained speculation that the president and his family were giving access to a Chinese woman who runs a string of sex spas where rich, powerful friends of the president were getting sexual services, would it have been any less shocking or disturbing than alleged stories about golden showers with Russian hookers? This case deserves further investigation by the FBI and perhaps congressional investigators. But, the story of Cindy Yang and her profitable venture in Trump world, based on what we know today, without an additional fact coming to light, underscores yet again both how unfit the president is for office and how his business practices and associations have created a national security risk for the United States. Dot once again. The president's actions humiliate and endanger the country.